Hello and welcome. Now it's time for Sunday afternoon football. Fantastic weather here today in Melbourne. The sides would be pretty happy with this turnout. And joining me in the box for some special comments will be Gary Lyon. Thanks, Hutto. I've been waiting for this game all week. Today's match, Essendon and Melbourne. It's a grand old fight. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The Demons' defence has a big job to do. If they can stop the opposition forwards from getting a few chances early, it goes a long way to winning this game. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. The captains of both sides make their way to the middle for the coin toss. Essendon wins the toss. Round seven. Come into this game with really good form. By contrast, coming into this game with some poor form. What an exciting matchup we have here today. Here's the bounce to kick off proceedings. One down by Gorn. Viney gets the handball away. Melkson with the mark. Almost directly in front here. Goes for the goals. And the chance at goal is taken by Melbourne. That's his first. Smiles all round. Melkson gets the first goal of the match. The game is back underway. Gorn won it down. Up for grabs for Shield. Heffel puts on a big hit. Puts on a big hit. Just goes bang. Uses the bump with quick hands. Decides to kick. A solid mark from McDonald Tip and Woody. 40 metres out. Going for goal number one. You can see that happening right after it left his boot. Essendon looking to take the lead with the next one. Gorn to bring it in. Great mark in the pack. Goes with the kick. He gives chase to the footy. Smith picks up the loose ball. Stewart wins the mark in contest. Essendon fans will rise if this goes through. And they take the lead. Stewart couldn't be happier with that goal. Essendon grab the lead. We're back in the middle to resume play. One it down. The ball in the hands of Harms. Applying the physical pressure. Hibbert uses it by foot. Well taken at ground level. Heffel slick with the hands. Just through the ball. Uses it by foot. A strong pack mark. Goes short by hand. Just through the ball. Kick by McDonald, Tip and Woody. A chance to reload the attack now. Slams it on the boot. McKenna hacking it out of there. Townsend just gets it onto the boot. Picks it up, able to release the kick. Tomlinson just put it on the boot. Heffel wins the foot race. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Jones just goes bang, puts on a bump, dishes it off to a player on the run. He takes the mark. Chips it towards half forward. Finds this one all by himself. Not happy with that kick. 
as it goes out on the full. Redmond goes with the kick. Great mark under pressure. Drives the kick hard. Does well to cut off the kick. With the ball now. Finds his man. The loose ball crosses the boundary. It'll be a throw-in. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Saad runs after this one. May runs onto the field. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Thumps it clear. Keeps it alive. Under some pressure. Found a way to keep it alive. And the ball ends up over the line. Toss back into play. Punched away. Welfie gets on the end of this. Looks to move it by foot. The contest, no match for him. Of course, Hunter. Bangs it on the boot now. Takes it well. Gets a hand to the ball. Wins the race to the ball. The kick from Shield. Danaher missed an opportunity to mark. Viney coming on. The umpire will ball it up. Gorn gets it down. Doing well was Jones. He wins possession, used the hands, and gives away the free. Gorn moves it now. Welfie runs after this one. Gets the handball away. Charges with intent. He goes for broke. Stewart just not good enough with that kick. Now they lead by two. Gorn players move as they look to provide an option. Gets it away under pressure. Putting on the butt was Lever. Wagner links with a teammate who can run. Takes possession. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. Moves the ball by foot. Takes the mark. Cuts the kick inboard. Danaher couldn't complete the tackle. Soccer's a kick. McDonald just threw it. So what can Bessenden do with this opportunity in front of goal? 60 metres out. We'll get a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Collected by McGrath. The umpire calls for it. Gorn won the duel. Salem found time to get it on the boot. Intercepts the ball well. With a driving kick. Ends up turning this ball over. Now with a low spearing kick. Doesn't hold onto the mark. The ball spills to McDonald. Langdon dug out the loose ball. Intercepts the ball well. Gleason drives the kick. Fantasia off the deck. That tackle just too high. Got boot to ball. Ball spills. Goes for the goals. The drop part sails between the big sticks. That will settle his nerves. Gets his first on the ball. Smooth loves that goal. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Back with another set of bounce. Gorn won the tap. And there's the siren for the end of the quarter. The scores are Essendon 14, took Melbourne 6. Essendon came out and started well. They deserved the lead at quarter time. Let's see what the stats have to show.
Essendon have had less of the ball, but they still find themselves in front. It's clear that they're using it better, and that's why they lead. Thank you, Gaz. Players ready to start the second quarter. Gorn thumps it forward. He's got the football now. Sweeping handball. Has a runner alongside him. Hands that ball to the opposition. Melcher puts another one through. That's two now. Finding his feet in front of goals. Gets some reward for his efforts. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Thumped by Gorn. Handballs. Turned it over. Hands it out to open space. Brayshaw just threw it. Phillips puts it on the boot. A chance to reload the attack now. Hannon drives a low kick. They chase after the loose ball. Gets a quick kick away. Great mark in the pack. Smith elects to kick. Sockers it forward. Fantasia gathers it now. The ball rolls over the boundary line. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. The loose ball scooped up. Gathers it now. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Links with hands. Lever, hurry kick. Gorn was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Gives it to McDonald. Tomlinson gets on the end of that handball. Salem charges with intent. Penetrating handball is in his possession. A great mark taken there. 50 metres from home. Can he put it through? A drop part through the goals. Melchior celebrating hard. Melvin, go back in the lead again. We're back in the middle now. Thump clear. Ends up with Chiel. Took his eyes off the ball. Collects the loose ball. A low stabbing kick. Hurry kick. Out of bounds, right on the 50. The boundary umpire will toss it back in. Ball back into play. Saad with a big fist on it. Tries to release the pressure. Jetta quickly out of the boot. He couldn't hang on. Gathered by McGrath. Movement by hand. With a burst of speed. McDonald decides to go for home. Drop punt straight through the middle. He puts through his first goal. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. Ten points the difference. Back in the middle now. Swatson, he's got the footy in his hands. Mops up the loose ball. A chance for Melcham. That's something to smile about. He loved that one. That's four in a row for Melbourne. The margin is 16. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. The game is back underway. Winning it was gone. Hacking it out of there. Doing well to intercept that kick. Kicks the ball deep. Great mark. Uses it now. McDonald tip and Woody with an easy mark. Elects to kick. Finds it in motion. Gleason kicks it. Heppel has it. Rushes with the kick. Drops the ball. Smith throws the ball away. Searches for a teammate downfield. A strong mark in the pack from Stewart. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Melbourne forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. What can you tell us, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Has a man running for him. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Pumps the ball long. Stands tall and marks. 
McDonald, interesting handball. He's got the footy in his hands. Kicks hurriedly. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Works it across the ground. Ball off hands. Picking it up was Wagner. Just gets it onto the boot. Smith soccers the kick. McKenna goes off the ground. He slams it towards goal. Ball to be tossed back in. The ball is coming back into play. Gets on the end of this. Takes possession. Slips the handball to Gorn. Welfie runs out of the field. We'll get a stoppage. Punches are clear. A clean collect. Finds the loose ball. Sark successfully sold the dummy. Viney just threw it. Chose to kick it. Couldn't complete the mark. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Moves it by foot. Winning the ball in the air was Viney. Now with a low spearing kick. Picked off by Redmond. Just put it on the boot. Shield gains some territory. Looks up with the kick. It's a poor kick. And it hits the behind post. Toss back into play. Punched away. Tomlinson finds possession. Is in his possession. Slick with the hands. Got the hands free. Snaffled up by Redmond. Hacks it out of there. Stewart has a great set of hands. 40 metres out. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Essendon keeping themselves in it. Gorn with the kicking duties. Needs a bit of a rest. You've seen a half now, Gaz. Your thoughts? Melbourne have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Essendon have been poor going forward today. The opposition are taking plenty of intercept marks and it's hurting them on the scoreboard. Thank you very much, Gaz. Two quarters down and only two to go. A big second half about to begin. Gorn thumped it clear. Goes by foot. Well picked up. Had the pressure bearing down. Ball picked up. Finding the loose ball was Fargo. It's a behind. Melbourne with the ascendancy over Essendon. Leading 31 to 15. Taking a nice grab. Puts it on the boot. Over the top of the pack. He's leading the ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of him. Good mark and looks to send it back. Melbourne just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Does well to cut off the kick. Brace York spills it. A good mark under the circumstances. Puts boot to ball. Gets into a good position to take it. Moves the ball by foot. It's marked by Smith. Goes with the kick. Laying a strong tackle. Outstanding pressure. Brown with a chance if he can keep his cool. 25 metres out. No angle to worry about. Going for goal number one. He's put that one through. Brown getting the crowd involved. Melbourne fleet the bombers by 22. Back in the middle to resume play. Melbourne have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Easily takes the mark. 15 metres out. Drop punt, finds its way home for Brown. Puts his second on the ball. They are starting to stamp their dominance on this game. 
His teammates rush over. Gorn gets onto the ball. Shield kicks in heavy traffic. Doesn't take the mark. Langford throws the ball away. Decides to kick. Jones, determined to reach the ball, just gets it onto the boot. Heffold scoops it up. Fantasia slams it onto the boot. Just manufactures what he could. He gains possession. He wins the ball in the air. Slams it on the boot. McDonald gets on the end of this. 65 metres out. Terrific mark there. Hannon sets his sights on the goals. 40 metres out. He likes his chances from here. What a lovely goal from there. He puts through his first goal. They increase their lead. Hannon loves that goal. About to resume hostilities. Guides it down. Heffel grabbed it clean. Ambrose with the ball. Gets it away. It's a turnover. Quick handball. Jetek receives the ball. He has the ball. Saad cuts it off. Merritt running off for a break. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? It's just not enough effort out there at the minute. Heffel contests the hard ball. Viney goes for territory. Goes for territory. He might kick a goal. McDonald goes off the deck and nails the goal. He's got a couple now starting to get into this game. Look at them celebrate that effort. Thumps it clear. Taken by Heppel. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Keeps the kick low. Cutler got the hands free. Pushes off the tackler. Intercepted by Viney. It'll be a free kick for that high tackle. A long driving kick. Contest the hard ball. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Brown guides it down. Now we'll get a ball up. Tap down. Dug it out. Cleanly picked up. McGrath picks it up. Just puts it out in front. Hit the man hard. Zaharakis puts on a bump. Ball gets cut off. The handball now from Harms. Handball finds McDonald. It's a big kick. And it goes straight through. Three goals for him now. What an effort. This league getting bigger now. He's enjoying that goal. Brown just slaps it down. Off the deck. Put his body on the line. Applies a bump. Intercepted by Hurley. Rides out the tackle. Goes by hand to Gleason. Off hands from Viney. Sockers it forward. Petrarca gains possession with the ball now. He gets his hands on the footy. Fantasia will be upset with that. Welfie goes with the kick. Thank you. Brown thrashes it. Phillips making his way onto the field. It's just a bit lackluster out there for my liking. Won the hit out. A good job keeping it in play there. Wagner sockers it forward. Just got the hands in the back there. Chose to kick it. Levick having a big game. He's getting off the chain. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Melbourne haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. The ball ends up going to ground. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Chance to put one through for his side. 45 metres out. Townsend knows the pressure of the kick. A huge moment if he can convert. 20 metres from home. A tough chance from here. That's true, Hutto. We have one quarter left to play. What caught your eye, Gary? Melbourne walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game.
Let's analyse the stats. The Bombers are struggling in the contested ball numbers. They aren't hunting the ball hard enough, and it's hurting them. Cheers, Gaz. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. Won the hit out. Jones on the ball. Quickly onto the boot. Can't take the mark. Petrarca not getting much of it, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Ball up in the centre square. The sting has been taken out of the game right now. Manufactures the handball. McDonald gets a quick kick away. They create the turnover. Saad quickly onto the boot. He takes it across the line. Umpire calls for a boundary throw. Thrown in now. Gorn won the hit out. Saw what was coming. Showing some really good pressure there. Ends up turning this ball over. Melbourne just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Chips it towards half forward. Phillips looking to track down the footy. Gets the loose ball. Hibbert gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Mark fights hard. Heads long with that kick. The ball rolls across the line. And we'll get a throw in. Umpire tosses it in. Gorn got in a better position. This is McKenna. Townsend keeps coming. Has it now. Harms clinks up with a chance to run. Fantastic tackle. Found time to get it on the boot. Just put it on the boot. Sarge slams it onto the boot. Does well to keep it in play. Good mark there. Big kick required from this distance. Winds up and goes long. Got hands to it. Wins the race to the ball. Just gave it away. May gets a quick kick away. Uses it across half-back. Great grab. Might be too far out to score. A mark by Fantasia. Melbourne haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Gleeson drops the mark. Hacking it out of there. Trying to avoid everything out there. Jones can link up through hands. Getting in the way was Heppel. Releases by hand. Got boot to ball. Marking in space was McDonald, Tip and Woody. 40 metres out. 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. He takes aim. That kick goes out on the full. Kicks it out of the back 50. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. He can take off after that handball. He's accepted. McGrath can bring the fans alive with this kick. Pretty happy with that one. Essendon produced the margin. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Gives it to Merritt. Tackle, knocks the ball loose. Salem throws the ball away. Zaharakis goes the long option. Dug out by McDonald, Tip and Woody. Good-looking kick off the boot, and it's sailed through. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? Essendon convert in a time of desperate need. Celebrating hard. That's a really good team, though. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Melbourne have got on top in the marks. They've been able to control the ball in the air and it sees them in this position. Melbourne, ruck work needs to be a bit better. Too many of their hit outs are getting sharked by the opposition. Mechanic with a penetrating handball. He's kicked it out on the full. Fantasia heading to the bench. Wagner going for distance with the kick. Finds a target. 
Kick by Brown. Smooth found a way to mark that one. Uses a short handball. Just releases the handball. He's got the football now. I hope that's not serious. He looks to be in a lot of pain. Difficult to see him coming back on after that. Goes by hand. Great attack on the ball carrier. Merrick keeping it low. Danaher did well to win that ball. This will certainly test him from this distance. A desperately needed goal here. That kick was pure. He's enjoying every second of it out there. Danaher celebrates with the fans. It's all academic from here. The result won't change, only the margin. Swatson, here's Oliver. He looks like he needs a spell. Takes a simple grab. Decides to go. Marks now and can send it back. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Melbourne forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Ball back into play. Hannon wins the ball in the air. 45 metres out. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. Looking to kick goal number two. Brilliant stuff. And he puts it through. And that puts them further in front. He's enjoying that goal. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Melbourne have been inside 50 less times than the opposition, but they're making the most of their chances, and that sees them in front. Not a great performance today, and in the end, a disappointing result for Essendon. Melbourne just know how to play together. It's been a solid team performance, and they can reap the rewards. At the final siren, it's Melbourne defeating Essendon. 11 1 67 to 5 3 33. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon. Well, thanks for having me. That's all we have time for. We'll see you next time. Friend.